Don't fail me. Ah! Hey, everybody. There's Welcome back. To stand on ceremony, my friend. Good timing. Your help again. I want you to go with Irileth and help her fight this dragon. You survived Helgen. I did. You have more experience but with dragons than anyone else here. It's not how you thought it was. Retrieving the dragon stone for foreign guards. But I, well, yeah, I did that. As a token of my esteem, I have instructed Avenici that you are now permitted to purchase property in the city. Speaking of that, there's a, I accept this gift from my personal arms. Uh, but I just got okay. Are you very much like Ooh. this dragon? No, I can't afford to risk both of you. I need you. Do I tell him that I wasn't really at Helgen? Against these dragons. Oh well. One last thing I serve you. your own fault. This isn't a death or glory mission. Oh, there you are. Hey, actually, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I have a daughter from you, or I have a sword for you from your daughter. This must be that weapon for the Jarl. Poor girl. So eager to prove herself. I'll present it to Balgluck when his mood is agreeable. Okay. Thank you. Please, take these few coins. Your service is rendered. Twenty bucks. No problem. Well, all I did was drop off a sword. Okay, Prongar, you feeling okay? All this standing around is rubbish. You should be taking the fight to the storm cloak. Oh, t or teleporting like a magician, like you are? Well, let's hope there's no quaking going on here. Okay, let's go sp spank a dragon. Now, first, let's see what we got for armor. So we got this. Oh. Destruction spells cost 12% less to cast, but it's... Okay, so that's armor 23. That's also armor 23. It's not any better than what we've got. What about this, though? They're the same, but it's new, and it's more interesting. Let's take this instead. So now, meh, sure, why not? And actually, that does go along with this one, doesn't it? So now I kind of look more like a... No, 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 no. You still look like a doofus. But you can now see the Wheel of Pain amulet. So that's cool. So we'll, we'll keep the Nord male hauberk. That doesn't hurt anything. And we'll get rid of the uh, steel armor later. Right? Anyway, what, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, welcome back. I didn't even... Yeah, I know you do. Um... We're off to kill a dragon. So we're trying to finish this quest line up so that we can start the Greybeard's quest and then be done. Now, question is, where did she go? Did we miss the speech? God, Whiteburn is just full of people just yelling at each other. My goodness. <sighs> then there's this blowhard. Oh wow, they're already gone. Oh shoot. I've wasted too much time. Oh no. This could be bad. I'm not lollygagging. I just happen to be a little late. That's all. Come on, come on, come on. Am I going to miss the dragon fight? They're going to get themselves killed. If I'm not there, what are they going to do? Well, they'll take it down. Ooh, pretty sun. Okay. Run! Run, you beautiful bastard, go! Where are they? They've got to be close. They couldn't have gotten that far. Uh, come on, you can go. Come on! Where are they? I mean, I know where they are, but... Oh, let's just cut across the fields. Oh, it's pretty, though. That is realistic lighting. Okay. Come on, Katsuragi. You gotta move. You've got to move. Wow, they're already there. I've never done that before. Shoot! I've always been able to hear the speech and everything. I did, I've never missed it. I know it looks bad. We've got to figure out what happened. If that dragon is still skulking around somewhere. Spread out. Look for survivors. We need to know what we're dealing with. Okay. 
Actually, if it's a dragon, he's probably flying, and I think Katsuragi would be smart enough to figure that out. So, let's do this. Um, oh, shoot. It's uh, 23rd, so it would be 10, 23, but I forgot my last save game. Let's just do 4, just to be safe. It's fine. Because I have died on this mission before, because I'm dumb. Wow. Looks horrible. Pretty horizon, but man. What time is it? 6 p.m. Ah, here's somebody! I found somebody! Where is he? Oh, hi! Yes? Where, where are you going? No, get back. It's still here somewhere. What? Rocky and Tor just got grabbed when they tried to make a run for it. Oh, crap! Where is it? Where? There you are. Go! Nothing. Mere Molnir. Well, I would, but... Come here. Oh! Ow! Why can we understand him? Partially because of the unofficial Skyrim patches. I think one of them actually fixed that, so if you weren't able to hear the dragon before speaking, they did repair it. Oh, man. Okay, that wasn't cool, and now I'm upset. Alright, Mil Mirmilnar. Stop that! Don't you use fire, you... There we go. Oh, and now we can't even see the... Where is he? There I am! There we go, see me? There, I'm right over there. Right there-ish. Get him! Get him! Get him! Give it to him! No! Yes! Even though I kind of look dumb. Let's take the horn helmet off, just so we can get the picture right. That actually went really well. Oh. Yep, we know how to do that. Let's do that actually, so we can get the ooh magic. Short the shouts, the shorts, the shouts. Um, I have zero dragon souls. That's right. So let's favorite that guy. All right. You got a bunch of stuff. I'll take all your stuff. Now I can't run. Dang it. That's okay. We're about to have a cutscene. Oh. You are Dragonborn. Come again. In the very oldest tales, back from when there were still dragons in Skyrim, the Dragonborn would slay dragons and steal their power. Stealing's wrong. That's what you did, isn't it? Absorb the dragon's power. I prefer to think of it as the quickening from the movie Highlander. No, I don't know what happened to me. There's only one way to find out. Try to shout. That would prove it. According to the old legends... Only the Dragonborn can shout without training, the way the dragons do. Dragonborn? What are you talking about? That's right. My grandfather used to tell stories about the dragon. Hmm! Those born with dragon shout. blood in them. Like the Greybeards like on their mountain. Said, huh? I've never heard of Tiber Septon killing any dragons. There weren't any dragons then, idiot. They're just coming back now for the first time in forever. But the old tales tell of the dragonborn who could kill dragons and steal their power. You must be one. Me? Oh. What do you say, you left? Being awfully quiet. This is actually Come great. On, tell us, do you believe in this dragonborn business? <laughs> Some of you would be better off keeping quiet than flapping your gums on matters you don't know anything about. 
appears a dead dragon, and that's something I definitely understand. Now we know we can kill them. Mm. I don't need some mythical dragonborn. Someone who can put down a dragon is more than... Wow, as the moons are coming up behind her. You wouldn't understand, House Khan. You ain't an orc. And you're dumb. All across Tamriel, I've seen plenty of things just as outlandish as this. Hmm. I'd advise you all to trust in the strength of your sword arm over tales and legends. Hmm. That was shouting what you just did. Must be. You really are dragonborn, then. He just got angry. Maybe that's all it is. Maybe it is a, an uh, impression of emotion. It's an expression of emotion. Inigo? Something on your mind? Yeah, what do you think of all this? I'm thinking, what is Mr. Dragonfly thinking? Of course you are. Okay, I do need help. I will bear your burdens gladly. Can you handle the dragon bones? Because I did take a bunch of dragon bones. I did take a steel nodachi, but I think we're too far down the path of one-handed. I don't really want to go back and try and use a two-handed sword. But they are pretty cool. I mean, they're neat looking. They do a really good job with them. So, I don't know. Well, I'll think about it. Maybe it would be something kind of cool if I read it for right now. Oops, I gave it to him. I didn't mean to. Uh, give me that back. Um, I'm still carrying too much to be able to run. Okay, what else do I have here? Oh, I've got the... Hmm. Well, Indigo, you're going to put this on, though, aren't you? Sure. Um, give you that. I'm not giving you the helmet, because you will put that on. I don't want you to. And we'll give you the steel armor. I think that's it. You can get him to do stuff. I think you can also program him, too, and how, what to wear and all that kind of thing. But um, I like it better just to have it natural. Just have him do what he's going to do. Okay. What's next? What's next? We go back to Whiterun, and we call this chunk good. Oh, I was going to show you the Nodachi. There you go. That's the Nodachi. So it looks pretty cool. For him to be walking around with it. Oh, I know. There's a couple of corpses here that have a bunch of stuff. I forgot. So here's one of them. Um, yep. I don't need to use the rest. I've ever been in, and I've been in more than a few. Yeah? I don't know about this dragonborn business. Yeah? I'm sure glad you're with us. You better get back to White Run right away. Zero fucks given. She just walks straight through that fire. My god. She's a machine. Okay, we've grabbed that one. There's another corpse, though, I thought. Because it was Froggy and Tor got grabbed. That's one of them. There's another one, and they have pretty decent stuff on them. So I wanted to grab it, if I can find him. Good grab when he tried to make a run for it. I think this is the one I have trouble finding. Um, oh wow, look at that sunset. It's pretty. Um, hmm, maybe I can't find it. It's probably around here. I mean, you guys have probably found it. I just, I never looked for it. I found the one corpse, but I didn't find the other. Maybe he ate them. Maybe Mir Milner, Mir Milner ate the whole guard. Alright, let's go walking on back. Oh, Tundra Cotton. I gotta grab some of that later. For right now, I think we've done enough. I'm glad you're on our side. For now, I guess. Sure. I don't even know what sides there are to be on. Uh, Kasaragi, you may want to have your earplugs in for this one. Just saying. <clears throat> and boom. First time that happened, it, I thought it, the game glitched. I swear. I didn't know what that was. So, yeah. So we'll go talk to Balgruff and get the Grey, Grey Beards quest started. And then we're done for this walk. Because then we can start exploring again. Because the walk to Iverstead is, a, you know, it's a long ways anyway. And we've already got, uh, we can already fast travel to it if we wanted to. 
But now, dragons are going to be starting to come out, and that also means vampires are going to start becoming a problem. So we need to start thinking ahead. And fast traveling all over the place is a good way to start losing townsfolk to those two things. Um, so let's be careful not to do that. I mean, we'll still do it, but sparingly. Inigo? Inigo, where are you? Inigo? Where is he? Inigo. Where did you go? You glitched over there somewhere. Why did you glitch over there? Okay, let's try the whistle. So, whistle to Inigo, and we do... Now, he should move. He's trying to, very hard. Nope, he's seriously stuck. Let's go see where we can find out why. Um, where is he? He's right over there. Let's see what's going on. Oh, he's just stuck in the field. Why? Maybe he has something he wants to say to us? Liao is yep. going to be very happy with you. Killing that dragon deserves a reward, I reckon. Maybe ask for your weight in sweet rolls. Mm, that's not a bad idea. I appreciate your forward thinking, Inigo. No, my mind is as blank as your expression right now. No offense. Okay, are we coming? Why are you stuck there? You want to talk? Uh, no, I just wanted you to come over. I hope this will be a mutually beneficial exchange. Now, really... If you need anything else, just ask. Okay, Let's see if he'll come along now. <whistles> yep, he's stuck. Okay, so let's just go up and we will, uh... See if we can break him free. Because once we go through the door up there, we should be alright. You heard him say that, though? He says, okay, I'm coming. Yeah, it's because he's trying to move, but for some reason something's something's busted. Not busted, but something's just being weird. It happens. Welcome to Skyrim, right? So, I could tell him to wait and then try and pick him up that way, but that's fine. All else fails. He waits there for a period of time, and then he goes back to Riften, and we pick him up back in Riften, and we go on. He doesn't lose any of his inventory or anything like that. So. Alright, in we go. And we should get him back shortly. I think maybe just, there's a lot of scripting going on with, with this quest. It gets really weird. There's a lot of different stuff. Like we have the Greybeards yelling. We have to go back to Jarl Balgruff. We have the big uh, kind of powwow that we have after killing the dragon. Between all those things, maybe something gets weird. Oh, these guys. We're causing no trouble. Oh, I love it. We will be back. This is not over. Oh, yes. We're looking for someone in Who are you looking for? I know. We're probably not. I'm that's fine. Go away. There he is. Now he broke free. So he teleported his way back over here, which is good. Are you still wearing the same? Ah, oh, you put on different stuff this time. Okay. <clears throat> He's wearing the steel armor now, which is fine. I like to give him all the sneaky stuff, though. There's Mara again. And Heimsker should have gone to bed. He did. But we still should be able to get into Dragon's Reach. Gosh, how late is it? Yeah, it's not that. Well, 10 o'clock. He may be trying to go to sleep, but we should be able to... Damn those guys to oblivion. <laughs> I laugh. Shut up. No one cares. No one cares about your aspirations. Okay. Should be able to get 
He should still be sitting there. Maybe that's part of the reason this is all kind of screwed up. It's not all screwed up. Really, it was just Indigo being stuck, that's all. Yep, they're still around. Hi! Good. You're finally here. The Jarl's been waiting for you. Hmm? You heard the summons. What else could it mean? The Greybeards. We were just talking about you. Oh? My brother needs a word with you. So what happened at the Watchtower? Was the dragon there? Um, I'm not going to ask for a reward, though, Inigo. That just seems too much. I mean, he's been giving me stuff as it is. I knew I could count on your relay. One moment, please. Calm yourself. Oof, duh. Sorry about that. I had to go kill a mouse. So that was what that was all about. I don't see any signs of him being this, what, dragon boy. Lord, nonsense. Why, you have puffed up ignorance. No, don't be so hard on Avenici. ...to go back to the founding of the First Empire. Oh, God. Don't be so hard on Avenici. See? I meant no disrespect, of course. It's just that, what do these Greybeards want with him? That's the Greybeard's business. Not ours. Whatever happened when you killed that dragon, it revealed something in you. Yes, they did. If they think you're Dragon Ball, who are we to us? Yeah, I don't know. You'd better get up to High Hrothgar immediately. There is no refusing the summons of the Greybeards. It's a tremendous honor. Oh. I envy you, you know. To climb the 7,000 steps again. I made the pilgrimage once. I made once. the pilgrimage once. Did you know that? High Hrothgar is a very peaceful place. Very disconnected, disconnected from the troubles, from the troubles, troubles of, this world. of this world. I wonder if the Greybeards even notice what's going on down here. They, they haven't, haven't seemed, seemed to, to care, care before. before. No matter. Go to High Hrothgar. Learn what the Greybeards can teach you. You've done a great it's service to me and my city. He always and he switches tone completely. By my right is yard. And he calls me Dragonborn. Yay! Lydia is a personal house car. Yay! Wouldn't want me to become common rabble. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have a city to defend. Yes, Actually, prevent us before you get too carried away. Do you know anything about? Why is the keep called Dragon's Reach? No. Tell me about the city's districts? No. Do I like to purchase a house in the city? No. You don't have anything on that Riverside Lodge, so maybe enjoy it's just there. I will enjoy it, yes. Let's go. Congratulations on becoming a thing, my friend. You wear the title well. Thanks. All set? I think so. We guys have to say no to Lydia. There she is. Trigger. The Jarl has appointed me to be your house caller. It's an honor to serve you. Hmm. Thank you. All right, then. Goodbye. If I need you, I will call on you. For right now, I think that's enough excitement for one day. So, thank you guys for coming along. We've finished up at least the first dragon quest, so now we've got dragons on the loose. And now we can go get the first, or the second part of the first shout. So we can start using shouts now. And it also means that things are going to start getting dicier with vampires and dragons, but that's okay. We've we've had enough of a free reign for a while. So thank you guys all for coming along, and we will continue with the next chunk next time. So we will talk to you guys later. They say if a vampire so much as scratches you, you'll turn into one. That better not be true. <laughs>